Good morning, friends. I pray that wherever in the world you are right now, that the next two minutes are a blessing to you, so you can be the blessing to the people the Lord has put in your life today. So this summer we've been talking a lot about just in my own little family, because we are a very words-heavy family. <laughs> we don't like to emote on the inside. We like to express it all on the outside. And because of that, words are many, right? You hear this in the Bible. You hear this. The words are prolific in my house. And um, so we've been talking about, you know, the damage that they can do and how words could build you up versus tear you down and how the Lord actually asks us to think about it, what it is that we say. So in the process of educating my children, I'm having to keep my, my own tongue in check and um, isn't that always how it is? And, um, and I was thinking about this verse in Psalm uh, 1914. It said, uh, it's a well-known verse. May the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be pleasing in your sight, Lord, my rock and my redeemer. And I was thinking about how um, the words that we say are one thing and the thoughts we think are another thing, but the words are always an outflowing of what we think. And the Lord doesn't ask us just to keep a rein on our tongue. He also asks us to hold every thought captive, right? When thoughts, unkind thoughts, when, um, when ugly thoughts come into our mind, we are to ask the Lord to uh, rule over them, to take them away, um, and to replace them with good thoughts. Which is why this verse keeps popping into my head. Um, Because it's not just the words of my mouth, it's also the meditation of my heart. And as we meditate on what the Lord has asked us to meditate on, his law, um, uh, his character, we then get so filled up that the words of our mouth are more pleasing um, to others and to him, more importantly to him. Anyway, that was my little thought of the day, my little meditation of the day. Um, And I hope that it's a blessing to you as you think about the words that you say today and the things that you think about and that you meditate on today as you go out or stay in and be the blessing. Until next time, Katie.